Yeah, because I was going to say, we, we, had a, we had some time, you know, while they were putting in their names. Yep. But yeah, some people are lightning fast with that, <laughs> though. Uh, all right, so we're going to see Ness <laughs> and Luigi. Luigi. Okay. This ought to be interesting. All right, so, okay, so which one do you think works better with Luigi? Luigi and Fox or Luigi and Ness? I'd say Luigi and Fox, just because they're kind of polar opposites as what as far as what they like to do. Okay. Because Fox can hunt people down and chase them while mm -hmm. Luigi holds on an area, so that allows you a little bit more flexibility in your game plan. Okay. Whereas it feels like Ness and Luigi both have the same things that they want, so you can run into these situations where you just end up colliding with each other. Mm -hmm. That makes sense. But um, at the same time, though, the edge guard potential of Luigi and Ness is yes. horrifying. And uh, town and city would be a very interesting start. I rarely see... You know, Luigi's got top to go here, but yeah. But I mean, um, when you have a Ness on your team, of course, it's get that blast zone. Right yep, and the up air, like yeah. Right. All right, so let's see how things is. I'm excited to see this uh, Ness and Luigi. Yep. Oh, good call. Just yep. yep. You know, smart. You know, just getting the back throw and try to combo with your teammate. Um, That's one of the tricky things. It's like you have to know when you can go for the down throw combo or right. when you should be going for the throw to your teammate. No, we're seeing a little bit of a little bit of awkward flipsies right now, but oh, is that gonna kill? Oh, oh, okay, I was gonna say off the top platform, you have to be careful. Of that. Yeah, and see, that's actually true. After the, you know if the you know your opponent dies in after that down throw, um, you can catch that uh, NATO. It's just, it's still a thing. Yeah. Um, ooh, the up air! Wow, wow. both actually killed. So that's a reasonable trade. I'd yeah, say. Mm, worth it. Oh, ooh, that yeah was a little bit sus. And, yep. Just gonna no jump. Oh no! Oh, no, if he had saved what? him, I would have been so bad. Like he was uh, already dead. There was yeah. no way that was gonna magnet hit from there. Oh, oh what are God. these offstage shenanigans? Why? Okay, magnet hit. Oh, <laughs> <Luigi ladder. laughs> that was. I think that was the most exciting like 20 seconds I've seen in doubles yet so far. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. I don't even know how. Ducks got back down there again. Yeah, I don't know what he did. Maybe he was sort of like forward a footstool with his invincibility. But, uh, yeah, right now we're just seeing kind of like a chaos of hitboxes being thrown around. <laughs> I mean, when you have four boxing style characters right. like this, it's an inevitability. It really looks like a, honestly, looks like a four player free for all right now. Yep. Oh, it's oh. just like everyone. Getting but. a strong spot on Ness, though, so man, she can take off the stock there in that melee. Right. And, uh, you know, it's not looking too bad for the blue team. You know, they're at very low percents and red team is at high percent. So if they can manage to take the stocks off both, uh, you know, Luigi and Fox, it's going to be, you know, pretty heavily in blue team's cyber. Yeah, but the red team is doing everything they can to stay out of those kills. Oh, situations. no! Home run coming out here. That somehow worked. Wow. The blue team is... Oh, get that quick 26% tack down there. On your own teammate, though. But uh, I, I like blue team's style. It's... It's so unorthodox, it's yeah. throwing red team off. And red team is very technically sound. So it's kind of like, wait, what do we do? Yeah. I mean, when you have both the Ness and the Luigi coming at you, it's like this wall of hitboxes. Right. It's really difficult to contend with. And it feels like the red team keeps finding these openings. But unfortunately, when they find them, their teammates there to get hit as well. Mm hmm just bullying this Ness right now. All right, I like that just getting him off stage, trying to keep his stage control. And then I like that how you saw Ness trying to forward air and um, keep the pressure. Oh, oh no, oh. Oh, heading the, that's a, yeah, that's a little bit tricky to yeah. come back from. Um, and uh, this is, I don't think this is too undoable for Luigi, but it's just a question of how do you stop from getting juggled too much. Yeah, and the real challenge is if Fox gets a grab, that's a, Free up be if they're in the right position. Right. Up throw up air? Yep. Nice. Up throw up air to up air. Yeah, that was, you know, it was, it was the weak hit of up air, so, you know, it didn't send them very far. Um, nice smash. I like that going for the edge trump to force them back on stage there. Yeah. And they respect, you know, uh, ooh, oh. I mean, He's definitely doing a good job staying alive. Yeah, here. spike him. Oh no. Oh, oh no, what are you doing? Could have just went with the drop down down air yeah. after that down beat. That's what I was going to say. 
The only downside is you'd be coming back up into a fox with no legend instability. Right. Oh, okay. Ooh. Oh, that's okay. That was, I was gonna say that was a pretty. That was a really solid effort by. Yep. By um. But when, rage. Yeah, but when you have a fox waiting there in the wings, ready with that up smash to exactly. come in. Exactly. It's only a matter of time. And uh, thank you. That was really good. That was really good from the blue team. Um, again, I think they're gonna benefit more from open spaces. Yep. So. Uh, and eliminating platforms too, you know, just so Fox can't juggle with up air. Yeah. Um, so maybe so something like uh, FD would work. FD out. or Smashville. Yep. Uh, you know, just give them a little bit more room to breathe and retreat to that platform if mm -hmm. needed. Um, right. But let's see what adjustments they make. So, yep, going to FD. Yeah. So it feels like, honestly, the blue team had a pretty decent game plan as far as just one approaching from above, one approaching from below, mm -hmm. to try and just create this difficult wall of aggression to stop. Yeah. But the problem is I feel like once one of them got in, the other wasn't really following up in the best way. Right. So if they could just up that teamwork just a little bit more, they should be able to take this game. And honestly, the blue team looks like sem like a semi-static team. Um, you know, like, oh, oh no. no. Didn't have a jump. Yeah, thought he still had it, but unfortunately that was not the case. Yeah, and uh, now blue team is going to be. Oh, yeah, that's okay. Even things up real quick. Uh, yeah, and uh, Fox is only at thirty-two percent. I just saw that. Yeah. I'm surprised, you know, you know, because given like Ness and Luigi, how easily they can juggle Fox. Yeah. And at uh, the same yeah. time, though, Fox has no problem juggling people as own right. Place. And. The, what I'm liking from the red team is they're more confident in how to bully Ness and uh, oh, I don't know what is go okay. So that's not how it works. I do uh, like I do like how he went down there to body block the side B because uh, if you see a Luigi side being from far away from the stage, yeah. one easy way to stop him is just body block the side B because he'll just get knocked back up to the stage right. and it'll completely stop his sideways momentum. Right, and I like that honestly. He's gonna try to catch. Fox is like landing by throwing out that NATO. Yep. And off stage, yep. And uh, actually, it's surprisingly even. Dux yep. is on the verge of uh, losing. Getting back. Okay, I was gonna say that kill, but that like, didn't kill. But oh. try to go for the clip there. Nice down here, sending yep, back up. Yep, spiking him. There it is. What you were mentioning. There is way too much on leg on that down B for you to be using it that close to stage. But when your jump's already gone and you've used your down B, you're basically out of options. At that right. Point. Nice, jabbing to get everyone out of that situation, get the blue team a bit of breathing room again. <laughs> we, we got the little pad in it, Luigi just like near to break out of anything. Yep. And uh, things looking a little bit more dire for the blue team, you know, they gotta figure out a way to force the share stock and then just isolate those, you know, 1v1s. Yeah, because I mean, right now, the red team has been just picking an area and just yep, holding there it you up. go. And no, you know, if they can somehow get um, Ducks off stage, ooh. Yeah. This is a lot more difficult now. Yeah, looks like it's going to be necessary to try. And I like that attempt. You know, you got to go for something risky. Yeah, you need to pull something out of this one. Right. That was it. He got me. Trying to keep it esports here, Advo. We're no, that's okay. We can, we can, we can say it is Advo. You see, this one said he got a big ass. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, back throw up air. Oh, okay, okay, good. Just going for the back air. Yep. I thought he was gonna just gr just hold him and not be him. Yeah. Just that's not all reach. They're just messing around now. Just not be him. Yeah. You have to be careful with the spacing though, because if you screw that up, you're in a big Spike trouble. Up. Back throw. Oh, good that was so release. Risky. Good release. Yeah, honestly, pummeling is the best case in that scenario. <gasps> Okay, that was so was gonna, again, you know, very close. That was, yep. but that was really impressive by Rage and um, yeah. Sin uh, Sinato. So we'll see yeah. if we can bring it back in losers. Yeah, I mean, they were able to keep it within a stock each game. But the problem was.